Hi, it's me Aisha. I'm here to present my proposed research plan. Title is Involvement of CD38 Regulatory MicroRNAs in Cancer and Aging and in Silico Approach. So here are the contents of uh, my presentation. First one is the abstract, then introduction and aim of research studies. After that, research methodology, justification of a research objective, then research hypothesis, limitations. After that, the future perspectives and references. So here is the abstract. CD38 is a bifunctional enzyme because it works as CADP or hydrolase and also as ADP ribocyclase. It contributes to the immunosuppressive environment during cancer and aging. Previous studies confirmed its role in multiple myeloma and other cancer types and aging. So CD38 is, is regulated by several microRNAs which will be identified by MayDB2. Resulted microRNA will be further evaluated by using micro tcds tool to identify the essential genes. The interaction of that number of essential genes with other regulatory genes will be done by using Biogrid. The investigation of the occurrence of these total genes in cancer and aging by using the cancer genome atlas and gen age databases. After that, I will design possible pathways to investigate the role of these selected genes in CD38 dysregulation either upregulation or downregulation during cancer and aging by KEC pathways or reactome pathways analysis. So here is the introduction. Uh, cancer is considered as an age-related disease condition. And recently, CD38 has been recognized as a very important regulator of aging process and extensively involved in cancer studies. CD38 has been discovered as a multifunctional cell surface protein in various hematological tissues, but particularly expressed by the plasma cells. CD38 protein contains 300 amino acids encoded by homologous genes located at chromosome 4 in human and chromosome 5 in mice. This enzyme metabolizes NAD positive and mediates nicotinamide dinucleotide and extra cellular nucleotide homeostasis as well as intracellular calcium. So over 90% of CD38 enzyme is acting as an acto NADase and utilize beta NAD positive as a substrate. To understand the complex mechanism of aging and cancer, Scientists are trying to find out the involvement of microRNA and other cell regulatory genes or protein in aging and cancer biomarker discovery. This research will provide an insight that which microRNA are responsible in the dysregulation, you can say that upregulation or downregulation of CD38 and their interaction with functional genes. This study will also suggest novel drug targets for cancer and aging. Here is the aim of uh, my proposed research that this study is aimed to determine the role of microRNA in the control of expression of CD38 and how 
these microRNAs and their targeted genes could contribute in the new era of anti-aging and anti-cancer therapeutics. There is an additional aim is that in future it would be helpful to build microRNA based aging databases. So here is the proposed research plan methodology. So in the first step, I will identify the CD38 related microRNA by using MayDB database. And after that, I will investigate the selected microRNA interaction with other essential genes by Diana Micro TCDS tool. In the third step, I will identify the link between these essential genes with other cell regulatory genes by biogrid and in the fourth step I will investigate the involvement of uh, n number of genes in cancer by using the cancer genome atlas or either the human protein atlas after that I will confirm the involvement of these selected genes in aging by using GenAge database. And in the final step, I will design possible signaling pathways by CAT pathway or reactom pathway. Here, I want to explain why there is a need to study CD38 regulatory microRNA in cancer and aging. Why I am talking about microRNAs that are the regulators of CD38 genes. Actually, I want to connect CD38 with cancer and aging through microRNAs. So here, is CD38 as I know that CD38 is a bifunctional enzyme showing CADPR hydrolase activity and ribocyclase activity. CD38 expression increases during aging in metabolic tissues such as you can say that WAT tissues or liver tissues. So CD38 uses nicotinamide dinucleotide as a substrate and catalyze the synthesis of NAM and ADPR. CD38 is a major NAD positive consuming enzyme responsible for the age related NAD positive decline. There is a study which shows that the CD38 is responsible for the age related NAD positive decline. On the other hand, if I talk about microRNAs, microRNA are a group of small single stranded RNA molecule and they regulate the expression of structural and functional genes. They can act as a suppressor microRNA and oncogenic microRNA. And one microRNA is 19 to 25 nucleotide in length. They are involved in cell division, cell differentiation, angiogenesis, the formation of new blood vessels, apoptosis, programmed cell death, and oncogenesis. So the problem that I want to address is that what are the factors that are responsible for CD38 increase expression, upregulation, or you can say that down regulation during cancer and aging. So my hypothesis for my research plan is CD38 is a protein coding gene, which expression is regulated, or you can say that controlled by one or more regulatory molecules such as microRNA. And these microRNA will provide a link between CD38 expression regulation during cancer and aging. So there is only a one limitation that I can think is that 
the in silico research approach which will provide new possible avenues to understand the different year transmission in cancer and aging so there is no experimental evidence present yet the future outcomes of this study will be the identification of novel anti cancer and anti aging drug targets second one it will help to investigate the age related or cancer related microRNA and it will also unravel the role of microRNA in CD38 expression regulation this is the short note of my presentation uh, shows that this will be a bioinformatic approach that includes several bioinformatic databases and research tools to investigate the connection between CD38 and its regulatory molecule, which are the microRNAs and the other cellular functional genes, either directly or indirectly involved in cancer and aging microenvironment. So here are the references. 